You were her opponent, obviously, not inside of her campaign. But from your vantage point, how does she run a campaign? Well, uh, I thought her campaign was actually pretty effective uh, against mine. She did do uh, her campaign, did very well when it came to social media. That was an emerging craft in, in politics at the time. She had a lot of support in S Silicon Valley that helped her in that arena. So I thought that was something that they, that they did very well. Uh, my campaign consultant advised, and I followed his advice, that uh, you can't be too harsh on a female candidate uh, or especially a female uh, candidate of color. So just be, don't, don't be too hard, Steve. And I kind of followed that advice, uh, which I think was good sound advice at the time. Um, and uh, overall, um, I, th I think the reason I did as well as I did, actually winning election night, uh, was because so many people in California knew her and didn't like her, including Governor Jerry Brown. Governor Jerry Brown told me directly he was voting for me because he did not like Kamala Harris. You keep bringing this up, her likability, and throughout the Biden presidency, her approval rating often trailed behind his, and it wasn't that high. What makes you say that she wasn't likable? Oh, uh, <laughs> from what I've heard from many sources, her interactions with other human beings is that she is arrogant and an elitist. Uh, and I've also heard uh, over the years, including recently, that she blames her staff for what are oftentimes her own uh, failings or mistakes. And that she goes through staff, um, uh, more often they'll say the average elected official uh, or, or a candidate. Steve. It's her personality. Steve, there's less than four months between now and Election Day. Obviously, this election has been shaken up tremendously. What are you looking out for next? Well, <laughs> I, I got to tell you, it's uh, it's been quite a roller coaster. Uh, it was a roller coaster before President, before the assassination attempt on, on President Trump. Uh, there's the Biden yes, Biden no, Biden's in, Biden's out stuff. So I think that... Uh, uh, based upon what's happened so far, uh, I, I think it's almost like anything can happen, except one thing will not happen. She will not win. She will not win because over time, she'll get more exposure and the voting public will be able to uh, evaluate her objectively. She's going to be scrutinized heavily, and I don't think it's going to do well for her.